let's level up how we can make transparent text. Usually, when we want to have transparent text, we can lower the opacity, which actually does a pretty nice job. But we can do better. Let me quickly create a merge visible layer, which I can use in a second for comparison purposes, and then hide this new layer. Now, for the text, let's reset the opacity to 100% and hide it for a second. I'm now going to add a levels adjustment and increase the output black level and slightly decrease the white level. Next, I will make a group of this levels adjustment. When I now drag and drop the text on the group icon to make a clipping mask, we get this amazing transparent text effect. Let's compare this with the opacity version by enabling the merge layer we created earlier. The before and the after. Pretty awesome. Here are some additional tips for you. We can add a Gaussian Blur filter on top of the levels adjustment and increase the blur radius so that the image behind the text gets blurred, which creates this nice cool glass kind of look. A nice feature of clipping masks are that they can be masked themselves. So I can add a mask, then drag and drop this mask on the clipping text layer and this will now act as a mask for the text. With the mask selected, using the brush tool with a black color, I can mask out areas from the text. To save some time, let me load the mask from a spare channel I created earlier. Quick look at the before and the after. I hope you liked this quick video. Thanks again for tuning in and until the next video.